So as you've seen over the many past years of this channel, I've worn Patriot hats like this, hoodies, shirts, sweatshirts, other hats. You've seen it all throughout many years. I've been a fan since 1994, uh, right after they drafted Drew Bledsoe. I like football. This isn't a video about uh, football fans versus gun fans versus soccer fans, baseball fans, and what you do in your spare time. It's a whole separate video. Some people like football, some people don't whatever here nor there and also this isn't a video about the national anthem whole separate video this is strictly about anti-gun organizations and the patriots are one of them so how this started was there was a mass shooting at parkland where many students lost their lives it was a mass shooting and their uh, students that uh, were with them their friends and co-students you know at the school they went ahead and started to uh, create a movement and they had march for our lives march for our lives had uh, many different angles, a lot of celebrities and a lot of different people that were there and trying to uh, help them out with their anti-gun agenda. So these students don't want to see guns anywhere. They're for an assault weapons ban. There will be no faltering, no pauses in our cause. Every moment will be dedicated to those pieces of legislation. Every march, every meeting, every moment. All for that assault weapons ban to keep these weapons of war out of the hands of civilians who do not need them. All for the prohibition of high-capacity magazines, because no hunter will ever need access to a magazine that can kill 17 in mere minutes. Therefore, you know, concealed carry, you're not having concealed carry reciprocity across uh, the USA. You know, they're for, for things that just don't line up with freedom. So how do the Patriots get involved with this? Well, they donated their one plane. Yes, the Patriots have, I believe, two planes, which is the only... Uh, football organization had planes. They donated their uh, one plane to these survivors of this mass shooting to fly them in to the March for Our Lives uh, event that happened in Washington. I believe it was Washington, D.C. And on that plane, they left a note for everyone. And this is where you can, you can see that it was the Patriot organization, not individual. So maybe it was from, uh, if it would have been from the owner, Robert Kraft, I probably could have looked past that. Uh, a little bit. But no, it's said in the first line, the first sentence or two, the New England Patriots organization. And it says down below that they're going to be doing like life changing things and they're doing such a great job with, um, you know, the movement that they have going to make our country a better country. I can't get behind that. As a, as a lifelong Patriot flan, flan, as a lifelong Patriot fan, um, I'm no longer a fan of the Patriots. The word patriot means a lot to me. My uh, natural rights mean a lot to me, much more than a football team. My allegiance to a football team that I've loved for so many years. I can't get behind anything that has an anti-gun agenda, especially something with the word patriot. The word patriot is very, very, um, it's, a, it's a strong word that means freedom. In and of itself, it just means you're a patriot of this country. And, and this country is founded on freedom. So you need to promote freedom. And that's not what the patriots are doing when they're supporting anti-gun agendas. So all this stuff I have that's patriots, I got this hat. I got a uh, nice little raglan kind of dry fit shirt, jersey. And as you've seen in so many videos, the patriot hoodie. Got this hat, we got some socks. All this stuff is getting thrown away or burned. I am not supporting an anti-gun team, and the Patriots are just that. So in the comments down below, like I said, go ahead and put, you know, what companies have you worked with before? Maybe you've worked with Dicks before. Maybe you've worked with Dicks before. Sounds sounds a little weird, but I'll go with it. <laughs> Maybe you've you've done business with Dicks before. That even sounds weird. Maybe you've been a fan of Dick's Sporting Goods uh, or something like that in the past. They take a one angle and you're like, you know what, I'm never going to shop at Dick's Sporting Goods again uh, or I'm never going to be a fan of the Patriots again because of this anti-gun agenda. You know, so leave that in the comments down below about your personal experiences. I'm curious to see what they are. I'm also curious to see if I notice any companies I didn't know about in the past. So this can be a video of a community of people saying, hey, these companies, 
uh, we've seen are anti-gun, maybe help each other out with uh, you know where we want to do business and with what, what companies or even sports teams, like in this instance of the New England Patriots. So moving forward, I'm still going to enjoy football. I'm just going to enjoy it rooting for the Rams. They've always been my NFC team. I've always followed them, loved Deacon Jones back in the day. But moving forward, I root for them, not the anti-gun Patriots. And on top of that, I'm gonna to continue to work on my concealed carry skills because constitutional carry is coming to a town near you soon if you're not in a state that already has that. So make sure you talk to your representatives to uh, enable your rights that you already have, that they've taken from you. Until next time, later.